As a freelance writer, you need to send a lot of emails to your clients, leads, potential recruiters, etc. Many times you have to send similar emails, your resume, proposals, links, etc. Every time if you write a new email, you will spend a lot of your energy and time in doing something that is quite repetitive. Fortunately, Gmail has a template option that can make your life and job much easier. In the 42nd episode of the Logo Files Lounge, I am going to discuss the Gmail templates, how you can create new templates, edit existing template, delete templates that are not required, and use it to make your life and job much easier. So I will share my screen and take you through the entire process of creating Gmail templates. This is how a typical Gmail looks like. If you want to save the Gmail template, the first thing that you need to check whether the template setting has been enabled or not. For that, go to settings, see all settings, then click on advance. There you will see in the second number, this is templates, right? Right now in this Gmail, this is disabled. If this is disabled in your system also, then tick this enable. Click on this enable and click on save changes. In this way, now the template settings has been enabled in your Gmail account. The next step is to save to create a new template. So to create a new template, click on compose. Then you can, so you have to write the content. You have to write the subject line and the email body. Once you have written the content that you want to save as a template, look at this on the bottom right hand side, there will be three dots. Click on these dots and then you will see templates. When you will take your mouse over here, this will come as insert template, save draft as a template and delete template. Since we have to creating our first template, so we will click on save draft as template. You don't have to click it, just uh, keep your mouse over here. It will come save as a new template. Click on save as a new template and then you can write the subject over here, the name of the template that you can remember easily and then click it on save. Right now this is saved. Now we are going to learn how you can use that template and for sending emails. So click on compose then go to these three dots, some templates and then you will see the list of templates that you have saved. We have saved this one, sam sample Gmail template tutorial. So click on this one and you will see that the subject line as well as the body is appearing now. What you can do from here is either you can send the email as it is or you can make certain changes so that you can customize it or personalize it for the person to the person whom you are sending, right? And then you can send the email. Also, if you have a standard signature in your email ID to make sure that when you are saving the template, you have deleted the signature. Otherwise, your signature will appear twice in the email body. If you want to change anything in this template, so what you need to do, suppose the changes I have to make is I have to delete the links from here. So I will delete it. I have made the changes. I have edited the content. Now I will again go and click on these options, templates, then save draft as a template. And I have two options. Either I can save it as a new template or you can save as the current template that you have created. So I will override this template, this one. It is saying this will override your save template. Yes, I want to override because I want to edit that template. Simply click on save and this is now saved. All right. So again, if I have to send a new email, I will compose. I will go over here and then select the template that I want to send. Click on this. You will see the subject as well as the body will come as it is. Now this has been edited. Similarly, you can create multiple templates and then send it to for sending it for different types of leads, clients, etc. If you want to delete a particular template, it's quite simple. Um, you can simply 
go here click on compose look at this and take your mouse over here on template and then you can delete template any template that suppose I want to delete this template I will click over here and the template will be deleted now no longer this template will exist while saving a new template remember that if you type the subject line then it will take the subject line automatically right so this is how you can save a lot of your energy and time in sending emails do you want me to cover any particular topic in this episode please write them in the comments below and i will try to cover them in the next few episodes do you also want to improve your email writing skills or writing skills in general join our content writing course from ect and transform your writing style in just 90 days the course cover all types of writing styles it has assignments quizzes live projects and test and moreover we give you individual feedback so that you can get to know where you need to improve what exactly you need to do to improve and hone your writing skills join the course now and accelerate your career progression today thank you very much for watching this video hit the like button if you like the video and subscribe to our youtube channel to get the latest update related to content writing digital marketing communication skills and personality development thank you very much for watching this video